Hi everyone, it's Van, and I'd like to share a project uh, that I finished for Halloween. Um, lately, I've been wanting to make Halloween uh, projects for some reason, and I don't have that many um, Halloween papers, so I um, used the October Afternoon Witch Hazel Collection from 2012. Um, and I used a craft pumpkin from Michael's that I bought a couple years ago. I knew I wanted to make a scene inside a pumpkin. And so I had cut a hole in the pumpkin, but I never did anything with it. And it just sat in the drawer for like two years. So I finally dug it back out and decided to... Um, do something with it so I came up with this like a graveyard slash pumpkin patch um, scene I guess so I didn't really all I did was carve the the hole was a lot smaller than this right here I basically carved the top off and then made a bigger opening so everything can be seen from the outside instead of you know, you having to really bend over and look close inside to see what's in it. Um, I filled the inside of the pumpkin with some Spanish moss that I got from the dollar, um, the dollar Tree. And I got this a few years also. It looks like they probably still sell it in like the floral section. But you get a lot for a dollar. And it smells okay, actually. It smells pretty good. So I just stuck that in there. It's not glued into the pumpkin. I just stuffed it in there um, and packed it in. And then I did a lot of fussy cutting. So I fussy cut the spooky tree, the witch on the tombstone, and the pumpkins, the cat. And I just... Um, used this instead of like happy halloween because um i mean it's kind of evident that this pumpkin here says october 31st but um yeah I, to make these stand i basically cut up strips of plastic um acetate that was for packaging uh so and then i um adhered that to the base of the pumpkin and then the clouds right here inside I used this Fisker's punch that I got a long time ago and I finally used it and these this is from the paper collection too and I have some bats in the back and then I um, cut this word out and I stuck an LED candle in there that I got from Big Lots and then up here I have another witch flying across the moon with her cat and I this is also um, held up with some packaging like it's just acetate packaging uh, and then I cut up some words here and that's about it it's pretty easy but I thought I really like it. I thought it's, it looks pretty cool. Um, I made something else before using this paper collection when I was the designer, uh, one of the designers for the piece by piece and that project is hanging in my office at work year round. I never take it down because <laughs> it's just I don't know where else to put it. So, um, And yeah, that's about it. Hope you all enjoyed my Halloween decoration. That's it. Alright, have a good day everyone. Bye.